guys, it's a brand spanking new week. It's Monday. Yesterday, John um, had a bit of a, a baking um, session and he made a lasagna so that it was ready for tonight. So we could just come straight home from work and we could eat it because um, I'm still not cooking because of my hand. Um, so, but basically we were saying it doesn't really look like lasagna. And this is a vegan recipe. John, you'll have to tell us what was in it because I don't, I don't know. Um, it was aubergine, like layer, layer, layers of aubergine, um, pasta sheets, obviously, chopped tomatoes, onion, tofu, lemon juice, and lemon. Right, lemon right. Wine, yep. And something else. Cool. And you found that recipe online? Yeah. Okay. Can you remember where you found it? It's on my phone. Though, okay. Um, but anyway, we were just saying that... We were just saying that um, it doesn't really look like lasagna. We should really call it a pasta bake because... What were we just saying? Yeah, we yeah. were just kind Because otherwise you're expecting lasagna and it's not lasagna. Yeah, it's not lasagna, is it? Because no. it's just... It doesn't look like a lasagna because it has no cheese, it has no sauce. and So really they shouldn't try to... Yeah. It's, it's a different dish, isn't it? It's, it's a not. different dish. They shouldn't yeah. try and they shouldn't try and make a cow look like a giraffe. <laughs> they should just make it a new recipe, like call it a pasta bake or something, because yeah. it looks nothing like a lasagna. And so you're expecting a lasagna, and you're going into the dinner thinking it's a lasagna, mm. when actually it's nothing like a lasagna. It's like a vegan alternative. <laughs> you. Yeah. The trouble is, we were talking about this while you were dishing up, and it made perfect sense. And yeah. then as soon as we go to do it on video, it's like we're talking <laughs> random rubbish. <laughs> Jump in if you yeah. think. No, no, you explained <laughs> it very well. <laughs> but anyway, we shall see how it goes. Yeah. Okay, yes, so um, that was very interesting. Um, <laughs> um, yes, incredibly, incredibly lemony, so we're aborting, which is a bit of a shame because there's all of that, but um, John said he would consider having some of it for lunch. I'll eat it for lunch. You'll eat it for lunch? Yeah, I'll eat any old rubbish for lunch. Any old what? Any old rubbish. Any old rubbish. <laughs> so we've got jacket potatoes going there in the oven. So we'll show you that when it's done. Um, but there's something else I want to show you. And I'm just going to put the washing machine on pause because it's making a lot of noise. Okay, so John thinks he saw an advert for this um, on Twitter. So it's a brand new magazine called A Vegan Life. And I decided to um, just bite the bullet and subscribe to it. It was... £14 for a year subscription, which and there's six issues, so you get uh, an, a magazine every other month, basically. So this is the very, very first issue, September 2014. Um, and yeah, we have no idea what it's like, but John's going to have a little bit of a flick through. John's my John's my hands. He's, he's quite good at being a glamorous assistant, so I'll just hold it over. So John's just going to flick through and show you a bit of what the magazine is like. Okay, so we've got sort of like, it's like a normal magazine there with like news and articles and views and stuff then. Some beautiful imagery. What's the paper like? Is it kind of like... It's all, um, feels recycled, recycled kind of, okay, yeah, so matte kind of. Matte, so it's not glossy, not glossy or anything. Cool. I'm presuming there's sort of recipes in there as well as, um, articles. Okay. Yeah. Oh yeah, recipes. Oh, that's nicely laid out. That looks nice, doesn't mm. it? Very nice. Noodles, noodles. Yeah, lots of noodles there. That must that's be a um, oriental section. Yeah. <laughs> oh, that sounds nice. Look, raw apple walnut cake. We could probably do that with the amount of apples that we've yeah. got on the on the on the tree. Yeah. Oh, that sounds really nice. <gasps> What's that? Raw cranberry apple pie. Very nice too. Okay, so it looks oh, like... Oh, hello. wow, hello. Apple crumble cheesecake. Hello. Right, John, get out there and cut, get an apple off the tree. Okay, so that looks like a really nice bag then. Impressed? Yeah, it looks right. It? Yeah. Well, we've got a year's subscription, so one every other month, so I think we can... And one of the things that I quite like about getting a magazine is I often get... Um, in fact, that, in fact, we used to get the vegetarian mm. life. Well, I didn't subscribe to it, but every now and then I used to buy the vegetarian life. 
and um, I quite liked it for um, you get very seasonal recipes particularly like I like it for like Christmas getting ideas for Christmas recipes and things like that so that's pretty good quite exciting and um, yeah well we'll obviously probably do some well probably depending on what the recipes are like um, show you some recipes from there but we've still got our other cookbooks that we're using um, and the other night so um, we've got a list of recipes that we're going to try so coming up this week we've just got our um, our list uh, we're mainly using the vegan cookbook um, yeah mainly using the vegan cookbook so exciting times exciting times and we're gonna have a jack potato for our tea <laughs> What's cooking good looking? Frog in a bog. Frog in a bog. Wind. Yep. Mash. Yep. Cool. Okay, so frog in a bog is what we call it in our slang ways, but it's also known as toad in the hole. And for people, because I've got some friends in the States who still don't know what frog in the bog or toad in the hole is, it's basically sausages in a Yorkshire pudding, which looks like that. And the sausages are corn sausages, so vegetarian sausages, and then a Yorkshire pudding. And if you want to know how to make Yorkshire pudding, um, John's did a video on his channel. So there we go, that's for dinner tonight. And, oh, and we're gonna have gravy. Yeah. Yeah, gravy as well, yummy. Tonight is Friday, whoop whoop, it's exciting because it's the weekend and tonight we are having burritos and they are from, John's just trying to find a page because you shut the book didn't you, admit it you shut the book yeah. didn't you, yeah John cooked, so we're having the spicy Mexican burritos and would you close the book please so we can see the title of the book, it's from the vegan cookbook by Adele McConnell and we've had this recipe before, it's really, really yummy. Um, I chose to do, um, I told John to do chopped avocado rather than guacamole, just because I like chopped avocado. Um, but basically the recipe is yummy scrummy and it's soon gonna be in my tummy. Hey guys, so um, Saturday we, um, went out for the day and we met up with friends in the evening and so we just had a takeaway together um went to the chip shop and had chips mashy peas and a buttered roll chip butty <laughs> sunday we um just had a pizza it was a pizza express pizza but it was from um shop bought from the supermarket and cooked at home because we'd been um, out visiting different friends on sunday so it was all a go-go this weekend went past in a blur um anyway do you remember at the beginning of the week i um talked about um the new vegan life magazine that um i'd got a copy of well um I had a second copy come through my door and I emailed them to say I had a second copy and did I was I charged for two or whatever and um, you know what did they want me to send the second copy back um, but then I said about um, doing these videos and that would I be able to give the magazine away to one of you guys so they came back to me like probably within an hour and said I don't know what happened but I wasn't charged, it wasn't an error on their part and yes, keep the magazine and do a giveaway so that's what I thought I'd do because um, I really like the magazine, John really likes the magazine it's beautiful inside, the photography is lovely um, the recipes look really nice, we haven't tried any of them yet um, but some really nice articles and we're really, really liking the magazine so if anybody would like to try one it's the first, very first issue of the magazine then um, leave a comment in the um, comment section below, obviously, and say that you would like it. And 
um, in a week's time, like so the next, um, the next week's vegetarian life, I'll tell you who's won, I will randomly pick, um, I'll randomly pick someone, what I'll do is I'll use like the random generator to um, randomly pick someone to win it and then I will email that person and you can give me your address and I'll send it to you. So I'll send it internationally as well if you want to um, have it abroad, that's absolutely fine. I don't know whether the magazine is available internationally though if you wanted to then get a subscription of it but at least if nothing else you could just read the first issue so if you'd like a copy of the magazine then just leave a comment below and um, yes and then check out next week's video to see whether you won or not so that's it guys we will see you next week bye